This is the StarQuest Headlines 2-Minute Update for August 6, 2018, brought to you by sqpn.com, where faith meets pop culture. I'm Dom Bethanelli. The big news over the weekend was the confirmation of the rumor that there will be a new Star Trek series starring Patrick Stewart as Jean-Luc Picard. The announcement came during Star Trek Las Vegas on Saturday, with Star Trek Discovery showrunner Alex Kurtzman introducing the surprise guest, Patrick Stewart, who then went on to say that Picard is back. There's no news on what the show will actually be about, although Stewart told fans to expect a very different show from the next generation, although nothing is set in stone yet. Keeping in mind that it's been 20 years years since we've last seen Picard in Star Trek Nemesis. No word yet either on when it will premiere, but expect it to be only on the CBS All Access streaming service. Make it so! Every summer, Carthage, Missouri is the site of a massive four-day festival called Marian Days that brings together 100,000 mainly Vietnamese-American Catholics for mass, prayer, and talks on life, faith, and family. The 40-year-old festival evokes the similar, even larger festival that happens in Vietnam each year in honor of Our Lady of Lavang. Carthage became the site of the festival in the U.S. because in the 1970s, a Vietnamese religious community of men, the Congregation of the Mother of the Redeemer, opened a monastery at the vacant Our Lady of the Ozarks Seminary in that city. The event took place this past weekend over the last four days. The country of France is imposing a blanket ban on the use of all smartphones and personal tablets by students in schools. While they had previously been banned from classrooms during lessons, now that ban has been extended to all use on school grounds during the day. Of course, exceptions are made for using school-provided tablets or for specific use in lesson plans. The ban comes amid increasing concern everywhere about screen addiction and overuse, especially by children. France is particularly tough on smartphone use in general, banning the their use by drivers and cars, even when the car is stopped and the engine is off. Perhaps feeling the heat over some controversial shows recently, Netflix has announced that it will provide a full slate of faith and family-based programming. Executives at the streaming entertainment company said their research shows it's what people from around the world want. Netflix has come under fire recently for shows that have promoted abortion, vocally rejected traditional moral values, and emphasized sex and violence. The announcement did not contain a timeline or any specific programming. And that's the StarQuest headline update. Find links to the stories and be sure to subscribe for our updates every weekday at sqpn.com slash headlines. I'm Dom Bettinelli.